It is time now for the mix, and the U.S. Open is underway right now. Mm -hmm. And you know it's a very classy event, <laughs> except for one very audible disruption from the players on the court. Case in point. <laughs> Some of them, I mean, you're talking about Maria Sharapova. She gets like to 93 decibels, which is essentially the same strength as a motorcycle, uh, a jackhammer, a chainsaw. So everyone's asking, do they really need to grunt? Is it a psychological thing? Well, in fact, a medical study has been done, of course, on this, and there is a slight advantage to the grunt. The reason why is when you're exhaling that much air, you're contracting your abdominal muscles, you're tightening up your core, and it actually allows you to perform a little more of a power exertion. 4%, in fact, of an increase in the ball's velocity with a little oomph behind the swing. Shira Velva always sounds like she's being attacked, though. <laughs> but hey, you know what? She's worth so much money, she can do whatever the heck she wants. And, and, and the doll does this thing where it's like, ooh, ooh. It's, it, you can think it's like the ball actually ricochet. I know. It's like, <laughs> at, at this hour of the morning, those are the exact sounds that you want to hear right now. But anyway, apparently there's more force when you do grunt. So it helps. take that for what it's worth. Now I have to show you some pretty incredible video. I've heard of these suits that everyone wears, but you have to take a look. Can somebody put a GoPro camera yeah. on this Unbelievable footage of you know it's almost like you're a, one of those uh, squirrels you know like those uh, what do they call them human like a human flying squirrel these are wingsuits and this wow. is the Alps and look how close it gets to the trees that's the thing you gotta wonder I mean you're just only a few feet away from getting boom hitting something but unbelievable go glow pro go. Can't say it. Go pro footage. Well, because it's like you're totally speechless from looking at this video. I mean, it really is amazing how you can. Maneuver oh, yeah. and just yeah, no, no. Too thanks. close sometimes, but yeah, yeah, adrenaline junkies. That's for you probably. Good from the comfort of the couch. This next story is incredibly heartwarming. <sighs> Two twins from Copenhagen just completed the Ironman. Uh, Peter Mondrup and his twin brother Steenbo, 34 years old. Peter has cerebral palsy, and he has now become the first person with the disorder to complete an Ironman triathlon. It took the pair 15 hours, 32 minutes, 48 seconds. They swam two and a half miles, cycling 112 miles, running 26 miles. They did it all together. It is definitely one of those inspiring things saying don't ever let anything stop you from achieving your dreams. And before we go to break, we have to leave you with this image. The cutest baby yeah. ever looking in the mirror and what does she see? Herself. <laughs> Look, I love you. I love you. I love you too. Another little smooch. <laughs> maybe maybe going to grow up and be an ABC News anchor. Perhaps. <laughs>